quite separate from the Pupils at this West London school are getting a hands-on lesson in biomimicry. They're learning how nature influences design and technology. It's particularly useful in engineering, but recent figures show fewer children are taking science subjects, something British defence firm BAE Systems would like to change. Dick Oliver is the company's chairman. We have insufficient engineers and scientists, we have insufficient people to feed the economy in the way that we want to, and we'll lose high-level, technical, well-paid jobs in the UK economy. And that's unthinkable. Why would we do that? We still have three or four of the best universities in the world in this country, and we have lots and lots of other educational capability and businesses. And we need to, we need to grow those, not let them shrink. Nothing to do with flying, though, is it? To help demonstrate that science needn't be boring, they've enlisted the help of wildlife enthusiast Nick Baker. The pool of future engineers is getting smaller, and also, for some reason, and don't ask, ask me why, it, it, it's sudden, science isn't seen as attractive to, to younger generations. What's great about the science of biomimicry um, and biomechanics is it's, it's the soft science meets the hard science. It's like a collision of the, of the two, of the two, well, three sciences, I guess, into the most beautiful things. It may be hard to see what this has to do with 21st century design, but without the study of biomimicry, some of the world's most important inventions may never have been made. BAE have developed a series of miniature robots for use in combat. Electronic dragonflies and spiders would be able to venture where soldiers can't. This is just one example of how biomimicry could be used to help save lives. The pupils here don't have to make any career decisions quite yet, but at least now they have some ideas which could help them decide. Well, I've always wanted to be a lawyer, um, but I'm not sure engineering or being a lawyer. Join the army. I'm not really sure, but um, I would like to like stay with animals and go on TV with animals. Very popular. They may not all want to become engineers, but now they have a better understanding of how some of the best ideas come from the most unlikely sources. Hayley Platt, Reuters.